Hello ladies and gents, Ro here, and welcome to Normal Films. Today we're going to cover a new update that was just recently released for iMovie, iMovie Update 10.1.1. Let's go ahead and jump into the App Store, and I'm going to show you guys how you can guys can get this update, and I'm going to cover you some of the brief basics of the actual update itself. Uh, I'll have a link, I mean I'll have a, <laughs> in the description I'll also have uh, what, uh, what this update includes, but iMovie 10.1.1, if you go straight to your updates um, tab on your app store, you'll be able to find the update and uh, you'll be able to update from here as well. But it resolves an issue um, with YouTube sharing that could prevent sign-in for users with multiple accounts. And this has honestly been one of the biggest uh, questions I've had and people have having this issue to uploading straight to YouTube and I've been giving them the workaround to export this file first and then upload from uh, your desktop or that front that file to YouTube and it works just as fine but uh, so I'm glad they resolved this and hopefully nobody else has any more issues regarding this um, also the this update fixes a problem that could prevent white balance adjustments from being applied to clips and uh, support for a Sony X AVACS clips captured at 100 frames per second or 120 frames per second now play correctly resolves an issue that could lead to incorrect display of still images and this was actually another common one also is I had a lot of people when they uploaded or imported a bunch of photos into their project some of the photos will come out blank or not even show up at all and I'm hoping this here resolves that as well um, clips are now copied when dragged from the project media container to events in the library list and then also stability improvements as well now I'm gonna hope ahead and open up my iMovie and I go to a movie about iMovie at the very top and you'll notice I'm running on version 10.1.1 I'm gonna go ahead and exit out of this I'm gonna open up my project and uh, there's honestly no big changes to actual iMovie layout but one of the major changes with the actual update is the share feature. Uh, when you go up to the top right hand corner, you've created your project, it's all done. You want to go ahead and share it, and uh, you want to go share to YouTube. They're basically, they've added uh, additional um, settings in order when you're signing in, and it gives you several, it, it prompts you to, when you have to verify your account, you should be able to easily verify it. When it prompts you to choose your correct account, if you have multiple accounts, you should be able to easily access that as well. And uh, there you have it. You give it a little bit of time, it should load right in, just like that. And uh, that's the basics of this update. Be sure to leave any questions or concerns in the comment section below. Thank you guys for watching. Catch you guys next video, and later. So let my life be